Live from the ABC7 Broadcast Center, this is ABC7 News at 11 on your side. And up first at 11, new and troubling accusations against Jose Pineda, a former substitute teacher in Montgomery County. Charges filed against him stem from an alleged incident at Roberto Clemente Middle School. But tonight, school officials tell ABC 7 that he worked at 20 schools in the area, a total of more than 100 days. And with those schools come more students now who say they were victimized by Pineda. Tom Rousey live in Gaithersburg tonight. So Tom, how long has he taught in the county? Well, Allison, at least since the beginning of last school year, and you know, he spent more time at this middle school here, Ridgeview, than any other school, 29 days, and it's this school that some of the new accusations are coming from. Montgomery County Schools hasn't given an exact number, but multiple new students have come forward accusing substitute teacher Jose Pineda of inappropriate conduct. The students go to Gaithersburg Elementary and Ridgeview Middle. And that's really troubling on top of the issues that MCPS has been having lately. The new accusations come after Pineda was charged in another case. The school district waited more than a month before last week telling parents at Roberto Clemente Middle about a September incident. Pineda allegedly grabbed a 12 year old student in the behind while standing next to her in science class and then inappropriately touched her in the leg and bottom up to five more times after she'd gone to her seat. At Pineda's Gaithersburg townhome, a light went off upstairs after our knock, but no one answered. Since last year, Pineda worked as a substitute teacher at 20 different Montgomery County schools. The school system says principals at all 20 have been told to send home letters. This comes a week after the district warned parents at 58 schools about a contractor accused of inappropriately touching two students in Damascus. In that case, the school system never told parents a thing until ABC7 broke the story. Especially with anything involving children, I would think they would want to actually come forward before having been pressed or being forced to and do it a lot more willingly. Now, the school system says police are investigating the new accusations against Pineda. As of right now, no new criminal charges have been filed against him. Live tonight in Gaithersburg in Montgomery County, I'm Tom Rousey, ABC 7 News. All right, Tom.